Assalamualaikum and Selamat Hari Raya Aidilfitri. This is a very special edition with very special guest right here on the RSS with HD. A very good day to you. I hope everyone's uh, having a good Hari Raya celebration. And look, even Harish is well dressed in his baju melayu as well. Now, selamat course, Hari Raya. Selamat Hari Raya. Of course, yes. uh, we're going to go straight into it. Let's welcome our very special guest for this very special day, Datuk Sri Noza Zakaria, the OCM president, as well as the BAM president. Uh, so, assalamualaikum, Datuk Sri. How are you? Uh, salam. I'm, I'm fine. Uh, thank you very much for inviting me to this uh, the RSS with HD um, program. Uh, congratulations to both of you. Uh, this program is uh, definitely, uh, you know, uh, it's, uh, it's fresh air to, to, the, uh, to the sports fraternity for me. Yeah, it's good. We haven't been thank shut you. down yet, so it's great. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anyway, take it away, Harris. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, before we uh, get into the questions, uh, let, let's start with Raya. Like, it's Hari Raya, correct? So how different is Raya this year for you and your family? Haris, um, mm -hmm. this um, Raya this year is definitely going to be a very quiet Raya. Yeah? Because um, as you know, uh, with this uh, MCO, uh, we are going to celebrate Raya um, just between family members. Uh, however, we are looking forward for this celebration. You know, it's end of Ramadan. Everyone is celebrating uh, Idil Fitri. And uh, tomorrow, Araya, um, it's the family. Uh, we will seek forgiveness uh, uh, between each other. And uh, of course, the highlight of the day is uh, the Araya delicacies. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, the ketuma, ketupat, lena, uh, lemang, rendang, and uh, the Araya cookies. So, yes, it's quiet. Uh, uh, of course, we are facing this unprecedented situation, uh, but, um, you know, uh, we all have to uh, make do uh, with the situation we are facing now. Okay, uh, sir, we, yeah, I mean, we, we are facing uh, an unprecedented time, but there is a reason to celebrate our national athletes young involved uh, in the to Road to Tokyo program. They'll be allowed to train starting June 1st. Uh, the way we see it is a first step for the government to allow more sporting activities to return. Uh, what more can we expect next month? Uh, Haris, um, of course, this is a very good news. Um, as a president of Olympic Council of Malaysia, I wish to express uh, our sincere thanks and deepest appreciation to, um, to the government. I, I would like to... Uh, 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 mention special thanks to uh, YB Datuk Sri Rizal Marikan, the Minister of Youth and Sport, who have been uh, working very hard to convince the government uh, through the uh, National Security Council and Ministry of Health uh, to basically uh, give the permission to allow our athletes, especially the ones uh, that are who are involved with this uh, route to Tokyo. And um, uh, I mean, you are right. Uh, this is indeed a very good news to the uh, sports fraternity. And I, I, I think this is uh, the beginning of, um, of the gradual opening up of the other sporting activities. Um, I do um, welcome this news. And, and I hope, uh, as I said earlier, uh, we will see uh, more uh, uh, so-called losing up of the uh, uh, training uh, 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 you know, programs. Do you think it will happen like immediately after, uh, you know, 9th or do you think, uh, June 9th, I mean, or do you think it'll take just slightly a bit longer? Uh, what, what are your thoughts? I mean, wh when will we see um, the loosening up of more um, events or more activities? Uh, it all depends whether, you know, um, again, uh, you know, during, uh, the government is, is quite worried about this uh, Hari Raya celebration. Yeah. Whether we will see uh, the spike in terms of the increase in uh, COVID-19 uh, uh, cases. cases, yeah. So uh, let's uh, 
let's um, you know basically um, see uh, what happened during this uh, celebration period. Mm-hmm. I do hope uh, we are all, um, especially um, uh, Riot Malaysia, will take that uh, self regulated um, haraya, you know, uh, uh, adhering to all these SOPs. And mm-hmm. uh, if we all jaga, kita jaga uh, uh, masing-masing, uh, and, and definitely if we follow the SOP, and uh, mm-hmm. we will definitely wait for more, more, uh, more good news will come uh, after that, you know. And now the badminton players will also start training, and uh, they are all housed at uh, Academy Badminton Malaysia yes. for 30 days. Yes. Uh, they're not they're not allowed to go out. Um, yes. So, so what um you know th- there are some some suggestions that um you know perhaps there be some initiatives for them provide video games or some form of activities to to make their stay their 30 day uh, stay more comfortable. Uh, to me personally, I feel it's only 30 days and not 30 years, lah. <laughs> so, but but your your thoughts, sir? Okay, uh, I think whatever action that uh, we take, uh, the uh, safety, mm-hmm. the health, and the well-being of the athletes and the coaches are, are, are utmost important. Yeah. Yes. So um, in this case, uh, it is a quarantine mode. Mm-hmm. It is not a prison mode. Uh, <laughs> I think. Uh, Everyone, uh, all the athletes are actually looking forward to have yeah. this uh, training. Yeah. For a very long time, more than two months, they uh, they were uh, locked up in their own uh, respective homes. Mm-hmm. I think uh, it is an opportunity for them to come back, uh, mm-hmm. to bring back uh, their level of playing, you know, mm-hmm. to bring mm-hmm. back their level of fitness. Mm-hmm. And uh, I think, um, as I said, um, you know, um, uh, they, they, they are all looking forward. However, um, being a responsible uh, organization like BAM, mm-hmm. we uh, will, will definitely, as I said earlier, will take care of their well-being and their mental state. Mm-hmm. Uh, we will provide all the necessary um, recreational facilities and equipment. Mm-hmm. Uh, like you said just now, uh, there'll be a special TV room, there'll be mm-hmm. a library, there'll be uh, ping pong tables. Mm-hmm. Maybe uh, board games, you know. Mm-hmm. So, so are the Xbox I, lah? So what? Are the Sorry? Xbox ataupun PlayStation lah? Yes, yes, yes. Oh, I, I think, yeah, yeah. So, 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 uh, so, I, so Dato, how, how does one join the BM uh, the next 30 days? Uh, <laughs> no, they play among themselves. <laughs> they are under quarantine. Yeah. Rashid wants to be yeah. a badminton player yeah. now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, so, uh, what is he saying? Uh. Yeah, we'll keep you informed, Rashid. Yeah, <laughs> there's any good news. <laughs> so, again, at the end of the day, I think I do agree with you, uh, Haris. Uh, it's 30 days. And um, uh, I think the government has been very reasonable with 30 days instead of maybe uh, two or three months. Uh, we will take this opportunity, uh, again, as I said, um, implementing those strict uh, protocol and procedures so that uh, we will not, um, again, um, you know, um, uh, if we don't want any... Uh, case of uh, uh, COVID-19, you know, uh, to uh, creep in or to come in into that uh, so-called um, uh, clusters. Uh, Rashid, you, you, I believe you have a question for Dr. Sri? Uh, yes. Uh-huh. yes uh, Dr. Sri, in terms of um, the, the we've, we've had a, uh, from the MME side, as you know, I'm the, the president of uh, MME yes. Malaysia, MASMA. Yeah. Um, yeah. We've wanted to approach uh, the, the government uh, obviously, yeah. with the help of the gyms mm-hmm. at the moment, a lot of gyms are, yeah. are inactive due to the MCO, yeah. and, and rightly so. Yeah. Um, yeah. Do we? How do we go about it? If if we were to ask for OCM's uh, advice into approaching the the government? Yeah, I think the 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 right um, uh, so called the focal point will definitely be uh, Ministry of Youth and Sports. Yeah. I think uh, uh, you need to uh, write in uh, to uh, YB Minister, uh, Dr. Sri Rizal Marikan. Um, and um, I, 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 I do think that he is now uh, gathering uh, information pertaining to which are the sector basically uh, requesting for opening up. And uh, when the time comes, as I said again, it depends on how we celebrate Hari Raya, how mm-hmm. the, uh, in terms of the, the COVID cases that, that are registered in this uh, country. And uh, I think um, I think uh, with with if we do it properly, and uh, if we get requests from uh, you know association like um, the one that 
you are you are basically helming. Uh, so definitely, uh, I think the ministry will will consider opening up uh, all those uh, uh, basically uh, gym and and other sports facilities. Okay. Uh, Actually, uh, right, right to Minister uh -huh. CC to me. You know, uh -huh. I'll, I'll push it together. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, yeah. On another note. Uh, you were there for when we did the uh, charity MMA event where Harish was fighting back in November. Uh, what, what, how many seconds was that? <laughs> hey, Choi, don't talk about that. Lah. Yeah. Move forward. Seconds, uh, I, you know, he, he lost it. Just a uh, I mean, blink of eyes. Eh? Something like that. Very brave of him to come into the cage. Yeah, yeah. In, in brave, Harish. Congratulations to you. You're very how, brave. How, how do we... Um, because we, we would, would like to get some... Uh, in, in, recognition from from OCM what are the procedures for us to to get recognition and be part of uh, o uh, Olympic Council of Malaysia um uh, uh, Rashid uh, as you know now um, uh, OCM um, basically has uh, 56 athletes yeah uh, 35 of them are full athletes and the rest are associate members uh, we have our uh, our own uh, so-called uh, process and procedures uh, it is good that if you write to uh, to me uh, and we basically uh, 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 provide you the necessary uh, form and uh, the necessary uh, so-called uh, give you guidance in terms of the process mm. and uh, uh, we'll take it from there. Yeah. So uh, definitely we welcome, uh, you know, more members uh, to register under the umbrella of OCM. Okay. Thank you very much. Yeah. And uh, congratulations with, uh, you know, the good work that uh, you have done. Uh, in MMA, yeah, we still still a lot of work to do. I think you have a very good ambassador uh, or, or mascot. Sorry, sorry, or ambassador. So, uh, <laughs> so, 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 I think um, is a is a is a uh, you know is a um, uh, good move uh, to engage uh, people like Harris. I I, I was there and uh, it was an interesting match. Thank you. Harris. <laughs> Skateboard. <laughs> well, he was kind enough to say interesting, but never mind. Moving along okay. <laughs> very quickly, that's uh, three. Leading yeah. to what uh, Rashid had said earlier, yeah, about yeah. the industry. Now, yeah. the New Zealand government had on Sunday uh, they yeah. initiated a stimulus package to boost sports. Yeah. Uh, they acknowledge sports industry contributes billions yeah. to its GDP. Yeah. Yeah. Um, back home, do you think that it's time? I, I have written an article as well about yeah. about this. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, do you think it's time for our government, particularly the finance ministry, mm. uh, to look into sports industry to help the industry grow? Yeah. And it's beyond stimulus packages like tax rebates, yeah. you know, yeah. um, endorsements. Your, yeah. your thoughts, please. Yeah, Haris, uh, uh, that's a very good question. Um, I had this chance of um, uh, meeting and talking to uh, YB uh, Datu Sri Riza Marikan, our Minister of Youth and Sport. I think uh, his team is now uh, uh, gathering um, information from the various um, parties uh, within the sports fraternity or within the sport industry. Mm -hmm. And um, I think uh, they, they are currently engaging uh, the government, especially the uh, finance ministry, mm -hmm. in terms of uh, basically uh, coming out with some sort of, um, you know, initiative or package. I do, uh, I mean, as a president of Olympic Council of Malaysia, I am 100% uh, supporting this initiative, uh, mm -hmm. especially uh, 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 we need to take care of those people who are badly affected mm -hmm. by this uh, COVID-19 uh, uh, crisis. And um, uh, it is very important for us to uh, reboot and uh, rejuvenate uh, the, the, the system uh, so that um, uh, the industry uh, continue to uh, prosper. And, uh, and uh, all of us, uh, because, uh, you know, um, when you talk about sports, it's about passion. Uh, it's about, you know, doing things that you, uh, you love for the country. Mm -hmm. And uh, I, I don't think um, uh, we, 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 um, we should uh, 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 leave these people uh, unattended. Mm -hmm. and, and I think all of us uh, should work for and, and, and basically uh, try to uh, uh, convince the government that there should be a, some sort of stimulus package to the sports industry. Okay, very quickly before we go, uh, Dr. Sri, now we know for a fact that the OCM's uh, Olympian of the Year Awards will not be held this year, yeah. uh, g given the situation, but yeah. um, we've had some fallen heroes like, you know, um, yeah. the, the late V. Nellen, uh, FIFA referee and KLFA co-founder Jaswan Singh. Yeah. Um, and there are very many heroes that are still uh, yeah. around us, um, among us. Yeah. Will OCM consider having a simple yeah. yet meaningful celebration for its yeah. Uh, yeah. to induct 
these heroes into its Hall of Fame. Yes. Uh, Haris and uh, Rashid, um, we know that at the moment, uh, everything that we do uh, is basically guided uh, by the, uh, the uh, policies decided by the government of Malaysia through National Sports Council and uh, Ministry of Health, yeah, uh, during the National Security Council, you mean? Uh, Na National Security Council. Yeah. So uh, basically, uh, I think uh, we need to see what will be the uh, new rules of engagement or the new norms that will be uh, implemented post MCO. Yeah. Um, however, you know, I, as a president of uh, Olympic Council of Malaysia, I definitely would want to continue this uh, annual tradition of inducting uh, those people who uh, basically have um, have um, basically contributed con uh, contributed um, uh, significantly to the sport industry mm -hmm. i would think that um, you know uh, when the time permits uh, mm -hmm. we will be basically uh, hold this if not as as you said uh, mm -hmm. if not uh, the big annual dinner that we do uh, every year we will definitely uh, plan for something uh, simple and meaningful uh, so that um, we can uh, continue uh, this tradition of um, um, uh, recognizing or acknowledging the contribution of those people who have left a very strong legacy uh, in our sports uh, industry. Excellent. That's good well, news. Well, thank Rashid, you very much, we... uh, Dr. Sri. You want to go? F um, sorry, Harish, we'd like to go for the quick uh, show for quiz. What do you uh, think? Yeah. I think we have time. We have time. It's Hari Raya. Time. Okay. Okay. Uh, What's that? Very short quiz. You just. Pilih satu, that's all. Okay, Just uh, yeah. go on, yeah? yeah. Okay, <clears throat> let's start. Number one, Almond London atau Kuih Ros? Ah, uh, Kuih Ros. Kuih Ros. Baju Melayu Cekak Musang atau Baju Melayu Teluk Belanga? Ah, uh, Cekak Musang. Okay. You prefer duit raya atau hamper? Ah, uh, hamper. Hamper. <laughs> you prefer Olympic Council of Malaysia or BAM? Ah, <laughs> uh, both. Yeah, any diplomatic answer ni? <laughs> sports or politics? Sports, definitely sports. Ah. Uh, I just want to wish uh, Selamat Hari Raya, Aidil Fitri, Maaf Zahid Batin uh, to uh, all the sport fans outside there. And uh, again, as uh, we uh, keep reminding ourselves, um, stay uh, stay home, you know, uh, stay safe. Uh, kita jaga kita, uh, kita mesti menang. Okay? Uh, have a great Hari Raya. Uh, thanks to Rashid, thanks to Haris, and uh, I hope uh, even though it is very quiet, Raya, uh, let's make uh, full, um, you know, uh, full opportunity uh, to be with our loved ones, and uh, uh, and uh, again, as I said, um, have a safe Raya. Thank you. Thank you. you uh, took the words right out of my mouth. Once again, <laughs> <laughs> okay. catch us again on next edition of the RSS with HC. Bye bye for now. Okay. Bye.